Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to access multidimensional arrays with indexes. One way to think of multidimensional arrays is an array of arrays. When you use brackets to access your array, the first set of brackets refers to the entries in the outermost or first level array. And the each additional pair of brackets refers to the next level of entries inside. And so here they have an overall array object, which they've called ARR. And then inside of it, the first element is one, two, three. The second element is four, five, six. The third element is seven, eight, nine. And the fourth element is an array with 10, 11, 12, and then 13, 14. So array at position three, zero, one, two, three, will equal to this whole position, this whole array. An array at three, zero, meaning this point at the zeroth element will be 10, 11, 12. And then array at three, zero, one will be, so zero, one, two, three, and then element zero, and then element one. So this is zero, and a one is 11, 11. There shouldn't be any spaces between the array name and the square brackets, like array, and then they have a space here. They're just saying, don't put a space here. Don't put a space here. Don't put a space here. Um, so we want to use bracket notation to select from my array, which is this guy, such that my data is equal to eight. So we have my data, and right now it's set to my array, and it's set to position zero, so this guy, and then position zero. So currently, my array, my data should be set to one. If I console.log my data, this should be one. Okay, cool, so I'm not crazy. Now if I set this to two, uh, it'd be three, right? Because zero, one, two. So, oops, if I set this to two, we should have a three here. And if I set this to one, we should have a six, because this is saying my array at position one, so zero, one, and then in position two, so zero, one, two, six, six. Cool, and that's how indexing works with arrays. We wanna use bracket notation to select an element from my array such that my data is equal to eight. So we wanna set my data equal to eight. There's only one element where eight occurs in this data structure. Um, so what we wanna do is first off, we think about the overall so we have the overall array here. So we're going zero position, one position, two position. So ar ar array eight is in the second position, zero, one, two. So here we wanna start off by going two. Now let's say we got rid of this second element, we would have seven, eight, nine. Now what we have is we're looking at this array and we wanna be able to select element eight. So this is zero and then this is element uh, one. So here we'll add one, and this will give us eight. Now we can get rid of the console log and run the test, and that should pass. This indexing thing is super important, super valuable. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this, and we'll see you in the next lesson.